I, like, whether I have the right persona or not, I should be able to get to a point that, uh, you know, next time it for sure go up right, probably. I don't know. Hello. Not so hot lately. Uh, sure, I guess. What should we do today? Is there something you'd like to do? Um, I mean, sure. Yes. It'd be great. I think it'd help us both de-stress a little. Sure. Wait, I get to choose where to go? So is it just the park? Wait, do I have other options? It's just the park. Why, why give me the choice if I only have one choice? It doesn't make any sense. Why? But you find her... We'll find your what's-her-face as a placeholder expression. So funny. I don't remember where I picked that up from. It's been something that I've been saying for as long as I can remember. Um, there's a big lake there. Want to go? I guess so. Maybe I'll just unlock, like, more spots place. later. Okay, I love that place. Uh, no, I lost time again. Whatever will I do? No. Oh, no. Oh, we're in a boat! It's just like I imagined. The view from a boat is amazing. Yeah, the view of the other awkward couple right beside us. I love staring at them, too. Sorry for dragging you out on one of these. I was just so curious about what it'd be like. Uh, It's a nice view. Yeah, I love staring at other people. It really is. The wind feels great, too. It's so refreshing out here. Oh, I actually have a favor to ask. When we have to leave, can I be the one to row us back? After watching you row us all the way, all the way here, I just got this urge to try it. <laughs> It'll be my first time rowing a boat. I'm so excited. Sometimes we'll uh, take kayaks out on the lake during the summertime. Obviously not right now when it's completely frozen over. But during the summertime, sometimes we'll take kayaks out there and row around. We have two inflatable kayaks and like one big plastic one. I think we only have two paddles though. So if ever we need like a third one, if there's three of us total going out there, we need to go borrow a paddle from the neighbor's place. That's what we gotta do. I remember the last time I was out there kayaking. I did it with my two little cousins. I uh, I was in the plastic one and they had like the smaller inflatable ones. And uh, you know, I, <laughs> I was kind of trying to challenge them sometimes like, oh, let's go zoom in and I, you know, paddle like crazy and stuff like that. But uh, you know, as we were just exploring around, the younger one wasn't all that interested in, you know, paddling all that much past like the very beginning kind of stuff so past a certain point i basically like pulled her the rest of the way like tugged like is that the proper term there basically attached her kayak to the back of mine and i just basically pulled us both um was the thing and that was how that went the last time i went kayaking i know that cost me will grow stronger soon well, okay but i can't go. give a gift or anything like that so that was so fun thank you for taking me out Okay, yeah, I, uh... Ah, my throat. Apparently you're one of, like, the important ones with, like, royal stuff. Ah, so, uh, you're back. Yeah, I am. Hey. For Yusuke's info, there's a famous shogi player in Kanda, right? If we have time, then why don't we go meet them? Oh, yeah, I guess we can do that. Uh, so Kanda, huh? Where? Here. So, go start this confidant, right? 240 yen. Oh, we just go right into the church. Go to train station. So this area is literally just the church and that's it. Welcome. Lost lamb. What? Lambs who've strayed from their path and lost sight of their goals in this life are welcome here. Simply put, I offer solace and advice for those with worries or who wish to reflect on their past. Hmm. Hmm. Seems like a convenient place to... Wait, did he say reflect on their past? Using the confessional, calling friends into the confessional will cause time to pass, but they'll be able to recover a forgotten skill. Interesting. Wow. That might be quite useful if you had something you want to remember. Just make sure you don't offend him or make him angry by brushing off his advice. Oh, I should mention that every Sunday we collect donations here at the church. We have a modest reward prepared, so please come if you are interested. A reward prepared for a... For donating? There? Do we get to see, like, a holy relic? This is something that we discussed in my history class a decent bit, and I talked about it in my paper that I turned in. Um... I can confess. CONFESS! Father, I have something to confess. I criticized Pokemon one time. I... I, I don't know what came over me. Like, I... Like... It... It just took control of my fingers as I typed away at that script, saying bad things about modern Pokemon games. Like, I don't... I don't know what it was about it. Like... It was so awful. I can't believe I did such a thing. Please forgive me. Is, I don't know if that's what the people who hate my guts, like, online, because I criticize Pokemon, actually expect me to do an act. Like, <laughs> sometimes that's what I imagine. Um, that girl's playing Shogi. 
Maybe she's Hifumi Togo, the one Yusuke mentioned. Why don't you go ask her? Um. I. What? Um, yes. My overflowing charm seems to have reached Hifumi. Okay, so you need like a certain amount of charm here. I'm Hifumi Togo. Um. Yeah, it seems like a strange place to play Shogi, but um. I don't know, I'll say by yourself. I'm doing some research, so... And probably didn't matter which one I said there, huh? <sighs> Experimenting with new tactics is best to do alone in a place like this. Well, I suppose that doesn't sound too terribly plausible to someone who doesn't play. How do you know? Don't mind me. Please go ahead and pray. Fumi Togo seems to take a very tactical approach to playing Shogi. Felt like I can learn some tactics for the Phantom Thieves from her Shogi expertise. I should ask her if she'll teach me. Ask her. Okay, and now a thing's happening. Yes? Can I help you? So this is voiced. Um, well, illusion of choice. Can you teach me shogi? Huh? Um, you don't necessarily have to learn from me, you know. You're probably the only shogi options, player in this game, so. Such as playing online. Like I could learn Sorry. how to play shogi, but this is the only I way Joker can't. can. So. uh... Well then. Um, so. You like Shogi? Uh, I don't know. I, it's illusion of choice here. Doesn't matter. Huh? Oh, um. Thank you very much. Um. Okay, just a quick game then. Twenty seconds per move, if that's all right with you. Um, I don't know how to play. So yeah, I'll likely make her lose interest because I have to play her. I'll just move the pieces randomly. I mean, this is how a. Uh, this is how a bot would learn. So, I mean. So, this is your skill level, huh? The dragon which governs the blue sky has fallen into my hands. How do you intend to survive this? Uh, with blue eyes, white dragon. <gasps> no! It's checkmate, no matter how you look at it. Please concede. I mean, yeah, this is basically like my class I did on bots that play games. Where it's like, yeah, this is basically <laughs> where they'd start learning anyway. Um, I can still keep going. To concede is an act of admitting that you have lost with grace. If you aspire to become a shogi player, I recommend that you take your study of the game to heart. Thank you for playing. Well then, that will be all for today. Take me on in the multiplayer of Fire Emblem Fates, I dare you. May I request another match sometime? I feel a gambler's spirit <laughs> emanating from you. What, you think you can profit off of me? I'm gonna start of betting. That of a complete novice. Or just gambling on my moves. Um, you are different too. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. However, I will instruct you under one condition. You become my playing partner so that I can research new moves. Is that agreeable? Um, sure sounds good to me. Thank you very much. Well then, it's a deal. I'll teach you how to play, and you'll assist me with my new moves. I made a deal with Hifumi. Now we gotta go to the future, right? Ma'am. Cool. So, somebody had to have given you the strats for how to play Fire Emblem, huh? There's no way you would I think that quite <laughs> play those difficulties otherwise. Succeed at that many criminal acts. And yours weren't by the wit of an amateur. You had a professional who regularly deals with such tactics. You have an idea on who that is, don't you? I wonder how the heck I'd feel if someone, uh, if someone came to me being like, Yo, I saw your insane strats playing Fire Emblem on your channel. Can you give me advice to help my thieving ragtag group of teenagers? <laughs> you know, something like that. Obviously, that's not what we said to her, but, uh, you know, <laughs> still. Alright, cool. The Star Persona. Wow. Bam! Star Ko Koma Sabaki allows you to swap current party with backup members during Joker's turn. Okay. That's big. All right. That is very, very nice. Using personas of the yada yada. Koma Sabaki. Yeah, that's very handy right there. Okay, let's end here for today. No! I feel like playing Shogi with Hifumi has helped me sharpen up my knowledge. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna do much studying anymore. Cause like, I'll get knowledge through things like this and answering questions in class. You know, 
Like, I don't need to do, like, a mad rush to max out. Because it'll feel bad when it's maxed out and I continue to gain points just knowing that, like, it's not going towards anything. Because I assume that it doesn't go towards anything. It doesn't go into other things, I would, I would assume. So, yeah, there's that. Thank you for today. I'd like to thank you once again for today. Before you head home, would you like to exchange IDs with me? Exchange IDs? Uh, there's no obligation, of course. I mean, like, exchange, like, phone numbers or something like that. Uh, lucky me. <laughs> the arm squad. Nah. I still don't know. I still don't know everyone in this game yet. So I don't know, like, who the option is gonna be. But I thought we were playing Persona 5 Loyal. You know? That's what I thought we were doing here. Um, <laughs> but that's us. Until next Damn, time. I'll let you know if I come up with any new strategies. Okay. That was, might be handy to <laughs> influence my Fire Emblem playthroughs. With ID, she meant sharing credit card information. Yeah, let's just see who can go bankrupt first. It's like a game Monopoly where you're trying to bankrupt all the other players, except it's different because you're using their credit cards. Um, thanks for that book on speed range. You'll be able to get through this quickly. Cool. I don't need knowledge. Baseball skills. Um, so this comprehensive guide on increasing emotional depth on camera for film buffs. So I get like more gain from watching films then, right? I'm going to be charmed. I want to feel innocent crimes. Charm. So... This would just help me more in the long run than right. Probably. Mm -hmm. uh, films will seem more enjoyable once you understand Miss on Um, yeah. Miss what? Is this a French term or something? I don't know, probably. I've heard of it before. I don't really know anything about it or even how it's pronounced. So, uh. Oh. So you finished reading The Craft of Cinema. Miss on scene. I thought film was all about story, but I guess every visual detail on the screen means something. That's triggered a whole new perspective for me. I'm ready to watch all kinds of movies and DVDs now. All right. You now understand how to deeply enjoy the art of film and DVD. From this point forward, watching movies and DVDs has a greater impact on you. Oh, gosh dang it. Maybe I shouldn't have watched DVDs as often as I did. Um, just save them all for now. We're almost at the station. I'd say that was efficient use of your time. Okay, so we now have speed reading and, like, better stuff there, essentially. We can appreciate them a little bit more. Sweet. Well, uh, no one's texting me this time. Wow. Feels weird. So, okay, Maruki's always a good one there. And, um, I can go up with Takemi. Her next thing's available. And if I can for sure go up with Takemi. Run, maybe I may as well, right? Right? Uh, hi! I'm just gonna keep on saving, like, all the time. Save they already exist. Oh no, I overwrote my save! <sighs> you should ask me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, clinical trial? No, oh, the clinical trial. Sorry. I'm gonna pass on it today. Timmy is depressed. In order for her to depend on me, I may have to polish up my charm as a person. Timmy would probably depend on me if my charm were charismatic. Okay, so I need to do a smidge more on that front. I need to be a little bit more charming. So in the meantime, like, maybe I should go, um, with whoever. What the heck? <laughs> Maruki. I was gonna say what's his face, but the fact that me saying what's his face was mentioned earlier got my brain to just like naturally not say what's his face because <laughs> when you get reminded of things, you start noticing that you're saying them more often, and then it's weird to say them from that point. Hello, hello, Sage Serbo. This is indeed my first time playing. Never hey played any Persona game before, and it's been interesting so far too. Uh, scorch, not right? so hot lately. What well, makes me cons reconsider the lab coat? Okay, we've seen that before. I have time to say? You won't mind. Why are you for a chat? Um. Hmm. Wait, do I not have a, a counselor one? I thought one of my best ones before was a counselor one. Well, gosh dang it, now I have a slot because I just executed Ryuji's thing. So, you know, I may as well just... Okay, I'll be back. Give me a hot second. <laughs> I'll be back. I need to change my personality a bit so that you like me more. And to do that, I gotta go to prison. I'll be back in a hot second. <laughs> Give me uno momento here. All right, hi. Can I um oh. welcome to my velvet room? Uh, here. Yeah, yeah. So counselor, it's counselor, right? You'd be pretty silly if it wasn't counselor. Is it towards the bottom for like new royal stuff then? Um, counselor. Yeah. So there's that one. That's my only one that I have. Oh yeah, it was this thing that <laughs> I fused. Um. All right. Well. Small cost to pay for friendship. This is your power. Okay. All right, I got the stupid teardrop thing again. All right, bye. See you later, nerds. 
All right, now he's gonna like me a little bit more. All right, let's go. Let's go do the thing. Now he'll like me just that little bit more. We'll be sitting, chatting, he'll be like, huh, your personality seems a lot more teardrop-like or raindrop-like or whatever the heck that thing is. Hey there. Um, oh, it's you. It's gotten so hot lately. Do you have time today? Um, I feel like I've become closer to my rookie. Thanks to the counselor, Persona Niji Mitama. Um, yeah. Let's see here. We're gonna help him out. It's open. As the nurse sucks. Okay. Going ahead. Let's go. Rookie seems serious. Seems he'll be able to grasp something soon. Firmly grasp it. All right. No problems this time because we're not actually increasing the bond this time, I guess. Okay, well, Be next careful. time. Okay. Well, nothing happening. Nothing happened. It's like magic are using Splash. Alright, well. Ah, you're back. Yeah, as I am every day. Deadline tomorrow. You gonna be okay? The pictures are gone. There's no avenue to threaten us anymore. That is, if we're able to trust what Kanashiro said. Don't say such scary stuff. We can't relax just yet. We may still end up released from police custody for real that is unless they have a decisive they, unless they have decisive evidence like a confession um it'll be fine true there does seem to be some movement sis actually sent me a message saying she won't be home tonight there's a chance that the police have found their breakthrough oh does that mean it happened the timing is perfect i guess let's just hope for the best i'm gonna stay up all night watching the news to find out oh, i've got other texts no, go away! Got any good info? Even some gossip would do. My deadline's coming up fast, so I need something ASAP. Wanna come chat for a bit? My treat. Um, not particularly. I mean... So yeah, we can do Kawakami's thing or Bob. Um, I still need more guts for EY. Um, I need to do that request in Mementos for the cheerful fortune teller. And whenever I wrap up the stream, I'll just wrap up the stream in, like, Mementos. We'll do, like, the side quest in Mementos and then wrap up the stream whenever I decide that, you know, I'm done for the night. Um, and then I can do, like, some Mementos grinding slash persona gathering between sessions, you know. That's what's real efficient there. Um, so can't do, uh, so can't do your thing, Rebob, right now. So yeah, maybe we'll do, uh, sure, let's call the service. Uh, thanks for your call. I'm all here. Oh, it's just you. Oh, I've been here. Shibuya is getting more dangerous lately. I'm sure you pass by that area on your commute to school. But don't make too many detours, okay? I'll give you 5,000 yen to request me, but this time I'll be sure to do an extra good job. Okay, can we come closer? Thanks to the temperance persona. I like my bond will go stronger soon. Sure. Let's call her over. Let's bring her on by. There goes 5k. What? What? You're really going to request me? I'll be heading over right now, then. I'd appreciate if you cleaned up a little first. That'll make my job easier for sure. All right. Wait, but isn't cleaning up your job basically? Um, I love cleaning shabby. I mean, sophisticated rooms like this. It gives me a sense of accomplishment. Oh yeah, speaking of cleaning, I'm gonna have to clean this office space in my room like a lot in the next few days since it's looking like there might be a big group get together to finally play the SpongeBob movie games with childhood friendos next week. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to clean things up here a little bit myself. Um, the stuff that you see on camera is like the more tidy stuff. I mean, it's not like it's that bad, you know, but there is a lot of stuff that needs to be organized. I was in the process of cleaning things up a lot, and then the hot, hot water tank explosion happened, and then ever since then, like, it's been, like, on hold, you know. Like, I can do it at this point. It just, you know, it stopped as of that, and then I haven't really picked it up since then. This very master will happily be covered in dust, but then doesn't it pain your heart to be such a cute maid all dirty? Um... I don't know. It does. <laughs> oh, Master, even though your room is busy, your heart is so clean. I'll go ahead and get this over with then. Okay, it looks the same as before. This'll do, right? Keep being a little messy for that shabby chic feel, you know? And now, cleaning is complete. Speaking of, like, shabby chic feel, when I was talking with, uh, like, yesterday with one of the old German group people, um, we were talking about old vehicle stuff, because he's working on a vehicle as well. And I'm working on my old truck. And he was telling me that one of the styles that some people go for is to, like, take off all the paint and then pour salt onto the vehicle to purposefully make it rust. And then put some sort of, like, a coat of some sort of glaze-like thing over it. So it just stays looking like that forever. And then it keeps, like, just a very slight layer of rusted old-style look as the way to go. 
but you know, it's the kind of thing that you have to like really, really know for sure is the look that you want to get and want to be careful that you don't accidentally like rust it too much. I would not do that with my truck. Um, now clean is complete. But some of the pictures he was showing me of uh, some people that had done it with their vehicles, it seemed kind of interesting though. <sighs> I'm exhausted. Not allowed to work overtime during weekdays, so I rushed my part-time job after class ends. On my off days, I have to prepare pop quizzes and homework assignments. And today, I had to clean bathtubs and walk dogs before coming here. There's no time to rest. Uh, speaking of pets, who smells like a cat? I feed a lot of strays around my house. Yeah, my, uh, you know, you can't tell through the stream in a stream, but, you know, it's not like it's super great here in my room either. Mostly because, you know, <laughs> I pr should probably vacuum in here a bit more than I do. And my doogie spends so much time down here, you know, this is basically where she's sleeping every night. <laughs> You know, as long as I'm awake. So, you know, I'm gonna need to do a lot of vacuuming and, I don't know, a lot of freezing or something around here <laughs> is the case. Because my room smells like a dog. Is the case. Surprised that you requested me. I didn't think you actually would. It smells like a dog because I have a dog staying in here all the time. I'm not expecting to do anything weird with me, were you? Um, what kind of weird things? Mm -hmm. Gosh, I'm just a maid, so I don't really know. Anyway, let's stay under control and maintain our distance for the sake of our relationship. Uh, I need a nap. Sorry, just give me five minutes. Maybe ten. Well. And before you know it, time's up. Thank you very much. Oh, hey, do you know of any part-time jobs that pay well? Yeah, I have so many part-time jobs that I'm not going to at all. That keep on texting me, requesting my, uh, my help. I assume you make a lot since you can afford maid service. Let me know if you do. Yeah, I go to a parallel world and I uh, cause inflation. Um, illusion of choice. Well, uh, you know, it's for my little sister. She's sick, so I need money to pay her medical expenses. Hello? Yes, I made the transfer. What? Not enough, but it was the same amount as last week. I. You know. Yes, I understand. Okay, goodbye. Uh, oh, wrong number. Hey, sorry to ask you this out of the blue, but do you happen to have 100,000 yen I could borrow? I did earlier in this playthrough, but not right now. Wait, never mind. Blowing one of my suit's money would be the worst. Hey, you may have some money, but be mindful of how you spend it. You shouldn't be wasting it on services like this. Um, it's all for you. I need the money, so I do appreciate you requesting me. However, you're my student, so if we were to get involved further, it could get complicated. I did warn you, the rest is your responsibility. You're a high schooler, after all. That's a couple of companies trusting me. Alright, next level there. Temperance rank 2. Nothing at this rank, but we'll get other things soon. I'm not gonna turn the room into a Spongebob room. This is like cleaning up some of the stuff that's around here. Like, it's, you know, it's not like it's too dirty, so it's not too incriminating to show. But, uh, like, ah, if I can move the cable up. Over there is still, like, the boards that I broke for my technical breaking of third degree black belt. If I, uh, like, I still don't know a good place to put them, so they're just sitting on the edge of my, uh, on the edge of my piano there, along with the guide for o Ocarina of Time that I, I should have just put that away. There's my special edition of Xenoblade Chronicles 3, but I don't know where to put it. Like, I should put it up there with the special edition of Xenoblade 1 and 2, but there's Metroid Dread in the middle, so where do I put Metroid Dread? Like, I don't know where I should put these things, so I just need to find places for them. There's a heater from when we were drying the carpet during the hot water tank fiasco, some, you know, presents for family members and stuff like that. My Wii Remote Rifle. Um, there's my Ferdinand Von Eyer keychain that's sitting there, the other one's... My other Fire Emblem ones are kind of hanging up and around in places. I have some documents there, which one of them is a bill of sale to fill out for, like, my old truck to, like, have it in my name and stuff like that properly. And the yellow folder is, like, my business documents for the channel. So I recently registered as a business. Um, I still have, like, school stuff there. My family decided me to get me a uh, Kinder Advent calendar <laughs> this year, so I've been going through. Uh, I've been going through that. I have some work documents over there, and then it's just like you know, school stuff, backpack, laptop bag. That's my Switch bag and stuff. And then I have more stuff around the floor around here. 
So, like, it's not, like, dirty, unclean, per se. But, you know, there's stuff all around that I just need to, like, find places for. You know, it's not like a pig sigh of a room. It's not like one of those rooms that you hear about streamers having where it's just like they're stepping over trash and all that stuff. No, like, it's relatively organized, but, you know, this is not going to suit, you know, a whole group of people. And I'm gonna need to vacuum and, you know, probably Febreze stuff. Which I blame you for. With how much time you're spending here. We can blame both of us. I need a vacuum more. And you're spending a lot of time here. So, yeah, I need to find places for things, because, yeah, I'm running out of a room to put things there. So, yeah, my special edition of Xenoblade Chronicles 3 has just been sitting there for a couple months now. So, there's that. Whoa! I want to offer promotion of your channel! Viewers, followers, views, chatbots! Holy crap! Ah, oh, The Carvia, that secretly lurking nerd, was able to strike the ban hammer. While I, while I wasn't looking. Gosh dang it, I was getting hyped there. But I can't believe Carvia just out here ruining my fun. Unbelievable. All right. Can't believe Carvia's always trying to take the fun out of everything. Like, he's, <sighs> he's so awful at parties, you know? Everyone just wants to have fun, and he just goes around banning everybody. Um, three more to go. I'll see you later, Master. Unbelievable. Okay. <laughs> Got me left. Probably you can take your special edition of Xenoblade Chronicles 3. You have lots of room, no problem. Yeah, that's the solution there. There's Carvia coming out of nowhere with a 31 month resub, the absolute mad lad. I appreciate the 31 month prime resub there, Carvia. I know you can only use that prime sub in one place each month. So I appreciate you using it in your, for 31 months. That is insane there. <laughs> I do appreciate you banning the bot. Uh, this is Master, thank you for using our service today. I really want to do a lot more cleaning for you. Is that okay, Master? Um, is this the hard sell? Maybe. It had an ad. That was a bot, right? Yeah, that was a bot. I'm fairly certain. I very highly doubt it was someone coming in to mess with me there. Um, you know, I came, I banned, I subbed. That's what it did there. But yeah, more specifically, like, I should put Xenoblade 3 up there. Because then I could have, like, Xenoblade 1, 2, and 3 special editions all in a row. But if I do that... Then where am I going to put Metroid Dread? So that's the reason why I haven't gotten around to putting Xenoblade 3 up there. Because it's just going to switch places with Metroid Dread, and then I don't know where to put Metroid Dread. So, I'm... I'm conflicted here. And I don't know where to put those boards. You know? And that one board at the top is still the one that, like, broke, but didn't really, because there's still, like, the thread attaching them from that, uh... From that breaking. I, I don't know where to put those. You know, maybe, uh... Maybe we'll end up framing the boards. After, uh, after I managed to do my power back kick as well. But, you know, I still gotta pass my power back kick to, like, truly pass third degree black belt testing. Until, until then, they're just, my other boards are just sitting there, I guess, and stuff. So, you know, there's, a uh, there's that. Oh yeah, looking at stuff over there, speaking of, like, my business documents and stuff, and, like, my official business number for the channel, one of the people that I was talking with from this German group the other day, recently graduated from business and works at i don't remember what the name of the place is but it's like a business that consults for like other businesses and stuff and apparently i'm not the only person of that group that's doing their own uh that's doing their own business nowadays one of the people that i grew up with that i haven't seen in forever has started her own glass blowing business which it seems like she makes some really really cool stuff as well so she's like renting a place and doing glass blowing based out of there um and uh so, you know, there was a couple of us there that have essentially started, like, our own businesses. So he was telling us, like, oh, you know, if you, you know, register with us, you can get, like, so many sessions of, like, free consultation that can just help you guys out. And I was like, huh, that could be, a uh, that could be interesting. And told us that we might also potentially be able to apply for, like, a business grant through them, potentially. And it's like, that could be interesting. So maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll look into things there. So, and the person in question is the main person that I was organizing the Spongebob movie game shenanigans with. Who, uh, you know, I might be playing the Spongebob movie game here with next week. You know, so we'll, uh, we'll see there. Um, is stream buffering or are you buffering? You're buffering and you're boosted. It's fine on my stream manager. <laughs> you need answers. No, I just want to hear your voice. Um, no, you've got the right idea. Still gotta hit my quiz for the week. I'm sorry. Part of the job. <laughs> okay, this is driving me insane, so I'm just gonna drop the sales talk. Crap, my manager's coming. I'm um, well. I hope you'll request me again sometime. Bye bye. Bye bye. Well. <laughs>
oh no, police sirens and stuff. You know, those police cars, did something happen? So the next several days are going to be like sorting out, wrapping the last of things for family for the holidays. Figuring out if there's still anything I need to buy for any family members. Doing actual family activities during Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Um, and cleaning up both my office here and my room over there. So, you know, I'm, uh, I'm gonna keep myself occupied, <laughs> is the case. Um, wait, who is the kind of hot, not gonna lie, stream tag referring to? You had to ask! <laughs> Look at all those police cars, did something happen? If they go searching the premises. I just caught a breakdown, I can't handle this. Does that have something to do with those posters we saw? Did they arrest the Phantom Thieves? Mm -hmm. Still Friday.